Hey guys, I'm here to do a kit opening video today. I've got two kits to show you and I am currently in the process of baking a baby so I'm going to do this a little bit faster than usual. Hopefully. <laughs> so, as you see the first kit is already showing. I've opened the box again. I've been really busy once again. So, um, I'm just going to get straight into it. This kit here is a twin that I've already done. Um, though I'm not keeping this one. Um, if you can't tell that it has full legs and three quarter arms who this kit is yet. It is The Sugar by Donna Robert. Um, I've already done the honey kit which is my Amelia which you can kind of see down there. <laughs> and um, this was on special over here in New Zealand so I snapped at the chance of getting it. I really like the limbs I've always um, really liked the honey kit and I've always wanted to do the twin so now I can. I'm going to um, do him as you can tell by saying him as a boy not a girl. Um, I know a lot of people like sugar as a girl but um, my honey kit's a girl, so that's why I'm doing him as a boy. Again, I'm not going to keep him. And he will be for sale at some point. His head is so much bigger than honey. Well, Amelia's. So pretty, though. I'm sorry about the lighting. My room's a bit different in colouring today. I just love the detail on both the honey and the sugar. And he'll be the first kit that I've done with like a slightly tilted head. It looks really weird like that, but when you think of it, he's all snuggled up into the side of um, his bedding or something, and he'd look really sweet. My aunt really likes this kit. She saw him yesterday and fell in love. <laughs> so, hopefully he'll sell. If not, I'm sure she'll take him. <laughs> and then the other kit is at the back here. And he is the Tristan by Laura Lee Eagles. And I admit, when I very first decided to buy him, he was going to be a sale baby. Again, I just had no, like, I loved his limbs, but I had no interest in him. But when he arrived, I fell so in love with him that he is now going to be part of some changes in my nursery um, and I will do a video about that probably next he is just so well detailed and I've this is my first Laura Lee Eagles kit but I've always liked her work because she's got quite different looking kits compared to the traditional babies I guess they don't look pleasant all the time and that's what I really like about it it's more realistic this hand is my favorite it is so stunning. I just love his long fingers. It's so chunky up here as well. It's so pretty. And then his other hand. I just love all the detail. So nice. And like I said, his face at first I wasn't fond of, but I've come to really like it in person. I think it's just one of those kits where you either like it or you don't. So he doesn't look very pleasant. He looks a bit sad. But he reminded me of someone and so I've decided to keep him on that based reason only. And because those limbs are so freaking adorable. But he actually, I really like him now. <laughs> I like the fact that he looks sad, so you need to mother him almost. He's so pretty. And I have ordered him some eyes. Um, if his head will stay. I can grab them. Where did I put them? Hmm. Here they are. Sorry. <laughs> So here are his eyes, they're like a light blue, they don't look that bright in person. They actually have like a, um, 
sort of like a darker colour in the centre that's before the iris but it's not really showing up kind of makes them look grey um, but I'm not too sure if I'm going to go with those eyes on the end because um, the person that he reminds me of has dark eyes so yeah not too sure but he's got those ones there for now anyway this was my video thank you very much for watching and I'll be back soon with more updates bye